Welcome to Steamworks. I'm Tim. This is Tim's Top Tool Tips. From time to time, we're going to need to reproduce an accurate angle. And the best way of doing this is using a gauge. And these are quite easily made in the home workshop. Here I cleaned up a piece of flat alley bar to give us square edges. I need a gauge at five degrees and I'm going to use trigonometry to create this angle. Squaring the edges gives us our right angle. We know the angle, so if we fix one of the sides, we can calculate the other. Keeping things simple, I'm going to use 2 inches for the value of x. You could use 50 mil. It's just easier maths. This makes the value of y tan 5 degrees multiplied by 2. This comes out at 0.175 or 175 thou. With the bar sat square in the vise, I zero the digitals and drill the first hole. I then move in the X direction 2 inches. And the Y direction the 175 thou. A second hole is drilled the same size. There are now two holes drilled at a 5 degree angle. The bar is now mounted in the vise using two drill blanks to set the angle true to the cutter. Cutting horizontally now in this plane will reproduce our 5 degree angle. Milling this in one go caused too much vibration, so I had to change tack and nibble away from the sides. A final light cleanup pass. So how did we do? How accurate is it? Uh, looks pretty good to me. Spot on. It's always best to mark the angles because you're bound to forget and it saves a bit of time remeasuring them. I'm going to use this tool to make another tool to do some more work on Dayak. See you next time.